This video will explain the working cycle of a two-stage centrifugal chiller for gas turbine inlet air cooling. In this system the low temperature and low pressure gas is taken in from the evaporator, goes through diffuser, and is discharged to condenser as a compressed high pressure gas. Let's see step by step details. Firstly, the low pressure refrigerant gas from evaporator goes to first stage impeller of the compressor. Compressor first stage increases the pressure and temperature to medium range. The gas is then mixed with economizer gas and goes to second stage of compressor, which further increases the pressure and temperature. The high pressure and temperature refrigerant gas is then condensed in condenser in which cooling tower water circulates to take away heat of hot refrigerant gas. The condensed refrigerant from condenser goes through first orifice to lower part of economizer. The condenser MOV maintains liquid refrigerant level in condenser. In economizer, the liquid and gas refrigerant is separated. The gas goes back to compressor second stage inlet while the liquid goes through second orifice to evaporator. The economizer MOV controls the liquid refrigerant level in economizer. The liquid refrigerant is sprayed over the evaporator coils carrying chilled water inside. The heat of chilled water is taken by the refrigerant liquid and converted to gas, which flows to compressor first stage suction, and same cycle is repeated.